on the doms. We just took that off the screen. Can we switch that back to? Oh, Ryan's not even here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, all people need to do is just uh, switch back over to watch day trading radio. Mm. All right, I'm starting right. back up here. All right. Good. And that's good. Perfect. So now you should have the um, UH uh, UTS uh, Dom up here. And look at the look at the match here. Look at the comeback. The comeback by Yankel. I don't know what they put in your coffee, Yankel. Whatever. Fifteen hundred to fifteen fifty. Fifteen hundred dollars. Oh, no, now he's up. Gas is gas is uh, gas is uh, losing here. Yeah, and I was just about willing to give gas a uh, one of the first uh, shots at the uh, trade with live money, and he he might uh, he might lose the title before he even gets it. Yanko now taking the lead, gas. Gas is quiet. Let me fix it. I'm gonna fix this chart. This thing's a train wreck. I don't think gas has realized what's going on. Yanko just tearing it up now. Now Yanko, what? What? You know, I'm trying to capture both. Looking at both charts, my charts, everyone's charts. What? What style are you switched over to? This is. Look, I'm gonna be honest. I'm taking advantage of the demo fills here, right? Yes. You're not going to get yes. these fills in real life. Yes. And then here, we've just popped out of the Bollinger Band. So, you know, you're going to pop back into there. And yep. uh, Stochastic's over, over, over Salt. So you're going to get some upward action. So it's not, yep. not too much to ask for a tick. Now, the trade I've got on is actually a mistake. I meant to go a tick lower, but I got an entry a tick higher. Whatever. Um, so I might actually get some damage done. And it's not the way to trade. This is not the way to trade at all because, you know, you could have four winners for one tick, but then oh, one loser for four ticks yeah. wipes it out. So even with 80% yeah. winning, you're losing. You have to, you have to find that balance. You have to find that, that balance where, you know, computers think, do that. Yeah, but you can lose taking profits. It's possible to lose taking profits. That's, yeah. not, that's the mistake I made. Because the commissions will kill you, and you've got to you've got to just hold on to the winning trade. Yeah. You know? yeah. So as you realize this, you know, in, in your trial and error, how do you compensate mm. for that? How do you, what 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 is your final formula that you're working towards? Is the formula going to be? The final be... formula I'm working towards is just keep it simple. You're gonna you find support, which is a moving average. And you enter on the stochastics, and you hold mm -hmm. till they get to the other side. Yeah. And what's and your stop? It. Your stop is a couple ticks under your, underneath the support you've declared. And that's it. Mm -hmm. That's that's really it comes down to. I have to agree with you 100. You know. And, let and, I, and go up. with the trend. Go with the trend. Trends yeah. your trend. Yeah. And that's an important thing. That's an important thing. What are the totals now? Well, um, I'm, I'm, yeah. well, look at gas. Gas. What? You, how did he just get jumped out? He was just, as as Yankel was telling us what he was doing. Uh, gas is over there doing the same thing. He's like a, you know the ninja trader. Yeah, I'd have I trouble see, against him. I don't even see an order go in. I didn't either. It was so fast. I didn't even see an yeah, order go in. He's uh, twenty-two What's thirty-seven. Ah, uh, nonsense. Oh, look at that. Boom. You see what he just did? He is playing the same game. Boom. Quiet's good. Yep. Fly under the radar. There's the popcorn. Give me a tick. There we go. Where are you at, mate? He's at 2300. You're at 2125. Jeez, that's too close. That's very close. You're going to be confident. Uh, no. 2375 for Yankel. 
liking the action here. You know why? Because on the TBIX is going up, the Dendron's, I mean, the Diamond Foods going up, Cable Vision's going up. Uh, General Mills is actually holding up okay. The market's pulling back. Twenty-seven fifty now. All of a sudden, uh, Yanko has taken the lead here. Twenty-eight seventy-five, twenty-four twenty-five. Both of them are going head to head now. They're starting to throw big punches. And here comes Diamond Foods here, breaking twenty-four dollars and moving. You gotta keep an eye on these two now. It's getting out of hand. Yanko pulling away. Gas now starting to pull, put on the uh, put on the gas. Yanko here throwing ten contracts into the wind. Thirty thirty five hundred. He's up to now. Thirty five hundred. Thirty six twenty five now. Thirty six twenty five. Yeah. 26. He's taking. He's a thousand points ahead. A thousand. A thousand dollars ahead now of gas. Gas yep. here. Gas is doing well, but he's not playing at the same. Uh, you know, the same size. Like gas is throwing five contracts up at a time to um, to Yanko's ten contracts. Big spike higher. Just sort of cricket. Big bounce on Google right off the 200 period moving average in the one minute chart. And the market's doing the same thing. Yeah, yeah, this would be a nice day. Approaching four thousand dollars, Yanko. We're down to about thirty-four minutes to go in the match. Market's popping. The market's getting a little more volatile. Keep an eye on General Mills. Call him for a reversal candlestick to play out in this one today. And what I mean by that, we're going to watch this one close up near the highs of the day on General Mills. Looking for that GIS. Smith Dog, hopefully in a couple weeks it's going to be as live as you want to go, want to see it. Lifelike, I mean. And there's Andrew from Infinity in the room there, too. If you guys are interested in, in uh, learning more about Infinity Futures, there's your man right there, uh, Infinity, right in the chat room. His name is Andrew, and you could take him into a private message, and he'd be glad to help you. Or you could give him a call as well. All right, well, we're still here. Gas here still working his five contracts. That will to bring it bring it up a little. He might have to do something. Now, Gas has performed many, a uh, couple times, right, on the uh, Ultimate Trader Showdown? At least once, right, Gas? Yeah, Lear. Yeah. Uh, Lear, and he won. Oh, wait, was, that was close. What happened there? That was a good match. Did Lear come back? And win? I, 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 think, I totally forget what happened there. What was that? What, what, um, what was the final outcome? Yeah, yeah I result? flamed at the end. I held a, a long position. Yeah. It was close. It came right down to the end. Yeah, you were doing what you're doing, you know, just steady and steady. Slow and steady. Yeah, but he's, a, he's over 4,000. 
He's over 4,000 now. 4,425. Yep, 48.75 now. A little delay coming back to you. Yeah. Get back up there, Diamond. Let's close on the highs and just continue tomorrow. <laughs> a lot of controversy about that match. A lot of people out there saying that their jet might have been on some kind of performance enhancing drugs or something. Here comes General Mills pushing a little bit higher. Diamond Foods pulling back off 24. Really starting to move around now. Coming down kind of hard. Mm -hmm. He's done that a couple times a day. All right, now, now I'm in the 4,000s. He's at 51 quarter. Well, the ankle coming um, from down under. You know, I was just thinking, John, um, maybe the guys at Infinity, uh, Andrew, if you're out there listening, maybe if they could, um, they could like factor in a quarter point buffer or something on the uh, on this platform. So, it, you know, you have to go past that quarter, that, that one tick before it fills. Yeah. You know? Like the demo is. Yeah. There goes General Mills here starting to push back up. And let me, uh, you know, I don't have my charts up anyway, but General Mills here starting to move back up now. And uh, looking good here. A little bounce here on Diamond Foods. These guys are just, uh, you know, racking it up now. I mean, all of a sudden, they both put on the afterburners. They're up here multiple thousands of dollars. They kind of like this. <laughs> Yeah, the market's crazy right now, and it's working on both sides. One's long, the other one's short, and they both get fills. We could we could always to put a limit on the number of trades. That would be Boy, that's something that's gonna be well. That's something that's very important, and something you brought up. We haven't counted in commissions yet, mm. so this is really gonna come into a commission thing too. I mean, these guys are ro rolling off trades now pretty fast, and. Um, you know what? Every every match is a little bit different. This is kind of like a, um, you know, when something gets, when you figure out a, a way, way of doing it and beating the, you know, not beating the system, but being able to capitalize on the, on the way, you know, things work. But you're throwing a little, you know, monkey wrench. You know, I'm v now very curious to see how the live, you know, the live money is going to be different because it's going to play on their nerves right yeah. now. I think a lot of it has to do with the confidence um, of their trading. You know, they're not worried about, you know. All right, 5,000 now. 5,000. And uh, Yankel's up to three grand in commissions. So about a little, <laughs> almost half. <laughs> three thousand dollars in commissions. What's three his total? going to sleep well tonight. Yeah, a Andrew was out there. Was like, I wish this was real. <laughs> it was like back when I had my live account work. <laughs> yeah, that's this is not realistic. This is not realistic. You know, the, the uh, platform you know fills you right away. Uh, normally, if you had you know the contracts, you'd have to you know be uh, queued up here and get your fill. It wouldn't be as fast. Cablevision here pushing higher. I've had my my order sit on the. Uh, you know, waiting to be filled and wondering when it's going to get filled, and it could be, uh, you know, it could be, it could be a time. It could be, they could sit there for a while. Yeah, GIS pushing up. But on the other hand, you know, this is real time. It represents, you know, levels, and uh, you know, you take it for what it is. You know, you learn from what it is. You get to you need to see the platform. Platforms, you know, it's, it, as, as far as platforms go, instantaneous and the best you're going to get. And easy to use and, you know, you get a good view of how it works right here. Mm -hmm. Going live demo or with real money, you know, that you have to make your adjustments on. I mean, if you could just say, you know, if, if uh, 
you know, real money, you know, skews, skews the numbers a little, but they're still positive, and you're doing the right thing. Yeah, Athen, at this time, it can't, uh, that doesn't work yet. Um, but the guys at Infinity, um, I think they had plans to, to maybe adjust it for so it worked more like the regular demo. But, but they're both, you know, they're both, both competitors here are using the same, they have the same platform. So it's fair competition, but it isn't necessarily, you know, isn't necessarily realistic if it were real money. Sixty three seventy five for big ankle and uh, fifty four quarter for for gas. Five thousand four twenty five for gas. RPM, do you mind telling me what gas's commissions are? I think it was like eighteen hundred and seventy five bucks or something like that. Eighteen hundred. I'm trying to destroy him psychologically. <laughs> you, you don't need he's, his morale. He he came into the match destroyed psychologically. <laughs> <laughs> Damage good. You should say which player's got a handicap and what, you know? Oh. Chili McGee making an interesting uh and, um, analogy. So cable vision here starting to run a little bit more. Cable vision CVC. And let's take a look. Oh, I keep, keep on thinking my charts up, but um, you know, the cable vision, I want to bring up my, um, my chart for myself to look at anyway. And if you look at your charts on cable vision CVC, you're going to start to see that base we're starting to pull away and uh, today the volume is picking up a little the stochastic kind of pushing back up and we're pulling away pulling out of a base um a larger 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 inverted in the head and shoulders pattern but the momentum is on 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 and moving here hey johnny look at the rovi yeah rovi uh 3337 Still staying within that range. I'm showing 34.16 on it. Oh wait, well, maybe. Oh, you know what? My Rovi uh, froze up here on my chart. Yeah, it's up like two percent. I was wondering because I'm like looking at my account. I says it's up and it's. Yeah. yeah, when you when you looked at you pulled your I mentioned it. And you pulled your chart up. It looked a little differently when you put your chart up. Right? But, yeah, uh, now see. Yeah, it's at the highs again. 34.16. Oh great. It's just. Uh, Grinding up. Oh, there it is. I got it fixed now. Sometimes that happens. It freezes up on me. Rovi here, 34.17. That's good. Good, 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 good. 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 All right, we're looking good. Now that's the thing. You're not waiting at any type of line here. Um, What's the update now? It's a very close match here. The ankle's 7,125. And gas year at 6,362. So, you know, about a, a little less than a thousand dollars. Nine hundred, about a thousand dollars right now. Separating you guys. Yeah, yeah. You have a lot of commissions there. It's going to, in the, in, in the end, uh, which is great. You know, I love that little commission thing because it just adds a whole different, you know, uh, strategy and. You need to really map out your strategy. You can't just go ahead and just go, you know, hyper scout mode. <laughs> Got. Yeah. Could you discuss more your 
your experience trading live with with your oh. high frequency scalping? What did um, I? I've always been interested. In how you mean you, went, uh, you, you mean you tra trading with real money? Yes. Yeah, yeah, live. Oh, um, it it didn't work out well. Um, I wound up giving up all of it in commissions when I when I would have a uh, you know a day that was slightly positive. The you know three quarters of it was commissions. You know it it really. Um, the hyper scalping just didn't work. I mean, you, I, you know, in theory, I guess it would work a lot better if the commissions were, you know, ten cents or something. You know, then it would it would work. But at four fifty a a contract, it, it only pays off really to try to wait and get the better setups. You know, I, that's one of the biggest lessons that I learned from the, from the whole thing. If you were to say there's like an ideal amount of ticks that you would take per trade. Profit, what would it be? Like, what, what would be a golden if you're making that per trade? You're doing well. Yeah, and I think the answer to that is really based on the type of market you're trying to trade in. You know, because they're all different. You know, every day is different, you know. I, I remember back, um, you know, remember back just a, a couple of months ago, remember the, the market when it first started to get extremely volatile. Every day we were seeing a 10, 15, 20 point, point moves, you know, on the ES. And you could, if you could yeah. capture more of that, you know, th that was easier then, you know. Uh, and now, like just now, I mean, you guys are just, we're seeing a quarter point to a half point move in the last 15, 20 minutes, and that's it, you know. So I guess that yeah, if, you, if you force yourself to trade every day, then uh, you're going to have to change your, your I guess, your, um, your expectations on, on how much you can get out of each trade. You know, each day is different. And tap here, just spiking higher, marching higher, and tap. And uh, I didn't get a chance to cut a demo for the um, Trader Spotlight tonight, so I'll just go ahead and tell you guys it's going to be uh, Cousin Vinny at 930. So it sh should be a good one. Cousin Vinny always does a great show. I always ha love having him on. So uh, around 9.30 tonight, Eastern time. Oh, good. Nice. I think I'm losing here. Whoa. Well, you know, all of a sudden, Yanko is approaching that $10,000 mark. Now, considering this is a longer game today, but he will definitely... Uh, one of these two will have the, the biggest, uh, uh, will set the record for the highest profit uh, in a match. And we're going to have those statistics. TVIX approaching 16 and volume coming in on the TVIX. The cable vision here running. Uh, you gotta like that. You gotta like that, actually. Cablevision spiking higher. Sent out the tweet on that. Brazilian Foods holding good into the uh, little pullback here. And there, look at the volume spiking here on TVIX. I am very strong on the TVIX. We've been mentioning the, you know, the bizarre strength in it today. Seeing it clearly yesterday, knowing something was up. Now it's really starting to prove itself. TVIX here running. No gas in trouble. All right, what do we got here? We got. <laughs> oh, Yanko he got it. Ten thousand. Breaking over ten thousand. Gas a respectable eight thousand. We're coming down the last 15 minutes. Plenty of time left. This this this, this match is getting ridiculous. Oh, it's going to be 20 grand probably on one side or the other before the day's over. Got a whole 15 minutes left. Ten thousand five hundred to eighty-seven thirty-seven. And yeah, the dings are kind of getting a little bit ridiculous, guys. Sorry about that. I don't know how is to turn off this. Yeah, you hear. Yeah, Johnny, I never. The chat room complaining. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The armchair uh, competitor. Yeah, I, I never figured out a way to get the audio back through Skype yet, Johnny. 
so you're not uh, hearing everything that I'm broadcasting. So, yes, Vintage Car Hunter, I will record the show. We'll we'll probably upload that one to the YouTube YouTube channel uh, where the, the quality usually looks really good. Well, I tell you, gas is sneaking right back up. Now, gas has moved up to 10 contracts. Get on your gas. gas. Put your He's gas in your auto. 9,237 to 10,750. Mm -hmm. $2,000 separates them. Gas just did another 10. Does look a little weak here. Yeah. Mark. Cable vision here coming back a little. VIX here spiking $16 ahead of us on the VIX. Buffalo Wild Wings pushing a little higher. CHK not doing much. Um, again, General Mills here pushed back above 39, hanging out there. Brazilian foods, you got to like the strength of Brazilian foods today. Nice candlestick. We'll see how important that candlestick is tomorrow. But this, any, any sign of, uh, of a, a, a trade that's going to, you know, that's been perfectly planned out of Brazilian foods into this hammer. Hey, Nimble's saying that he's able to, to read the numbers and everything pretty pretty good on the uh, on the show right now, so that's good. I, I can I can read it too. It's really good. Uh, gas breaking ten thousand uh -oh. dollars. And wait wait ten thousand. Ten. He's catching it fast. Ten thousand seven hundred fifty. Oh, it's so ten, close. It is very close. Yeah, I'm only broadcasting at uh, like 250K, John, but I've got the frames per second to five. So I think all the bandwidth is going into each frame. So yeah. it's it's not a really fluid motion video, but it's just refreshing every, you know, every five per second. So maybe that's, I don't know. Hey, we got some popcorn here. Some volume. Oh, popcorn. Down. Yeah, I got my, I got my com combatant trap now. You got uh, now, trap. Oh. Yeah. My now friend, he's short. You may have won... You, you may have won a little battle, but the the war is still raging. I think you guys need to try to hang on to one of these, uh, either one direction or the other. Try to get more than a quarter quarter point. <laughs> well, you're getting annoyed at that. <laughs> we got 15 minutes to go. Gas gonna bring it home. All right, let's rock and roll with this, baby. 14 minutes left. Now, 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 Seven even out for the 80s trade here, guys. Eight, seven even out at nine even here now. One, ten, paper is for you. This is eight, nine even offer. Duh. Oh. Seven even out at nine. Guys, it's pretty close. Nine. Rovi popping again. New highs on Rovi. Oh, yeah. Rovi here. Cruising. Let's take it over. Wow, an impressive, impressive, impressive trade as you guys. I mean, now we have to figure out what, how much of this is due to the platform, how much is due to, you know, I mean, the, the commissions versus the the, um, the slippage when you do have a, uh, a live account. I mean, I wish we could, yeah. uh, you know, we're going to find out. Oh, this is nuts, this market. Yeah. You've got to factor in we are taking a risk on each trade. And yeah, you are. That up. So it does yep. take cojones to put 10 on, as Gas knows. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, I want to see you do what that with you uh, cojones. Nice. It's an Australian Fish. fruit. Take some good matzo balls. I just don't want to get trapped here with 10 on, you know? I can't repair. 
Now for you guys. What's the totals now, John? 10,000 10, exactly for... Um, um, <laughs> Yankel. 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 Cool. 10,000. 11,867. 62. Uh, 62, from, uh, yeah. Uh, for gas. He took a couple yes. losses. Yeah, he did. He took a couple losses. I mean, he's right at 10,000 here. He's off. He's, he's flat. If you both are flat. Apple so hard. Market has been getting a little volatile here. And it is choppy here. I mean, you're definitely getting some one point to pops here. I'm like looking at my chart. Mm -hmm. We seem to be a little more volatile right now. Yeah. Volume's in on it too. There's candles. There's one minute candles are a lot taller now. Yeah. A lot of chop. Has ES Junkie played a match? UTS match? Not yet. Yeah, we have to pressure him into it. Uh, we just haven't. He said he could do it. The, the, uh, he said Fridays. Fridays. Yeah, he said Fridays. Yeah, yeah I really would love there. some ES traders to come on. Uh, exclusive ES traders or focused ES traders to come on Trader Spotlight. That would be amazing. Yeah. You hear that, Paul? Get him up. Yeah, I'm sorry. I was talking to my daughter. She just got home. What, what was that? We were talking about ES Junkie? I would love to see somebody like ES Junkie or there's a, a few guys in the chat room. I don't want to mention their names, but they trade a lot of ES. I would love to see them on, on Trader Spotlight. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm always looking for people to, to come on the, the show. The, the problem is that a lot of people are shy or they really, you know, and we've had some great guests on, you know, and the repetitive guests are, are the best, but the, you know, it's always open, open invitation to anybody out there that would like to come on a spotlight. Um, please get in touch with us. Um, we'd love to have, you know, anyone on and including the yes traders, especially. I think it'd be a great yeah. show. Yeah, I'm pretty shy, Paul. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I still can't get you to come have on. Have you still got your show, guys? It's only uh, every now and then. Okay. You also take many questions. Number one to score is the 4880 Princeton here, guys. They'd have been at nine. <laughs> Man, these trades are quick. Number one score is the 4880 Princeton. Eight out for the man nine. Twelve thousand gas. Oh no. Yeah, yeah. Hey, twelve thousand three hundred and sixty-two here. Four eighty-seven now. Hey John, I'll give you my address. You can mail me the check. <laughs> <laughs> you know this after ruins your real trading. Right? Yeah, after the commissions, I did the stamp will be more than <laughs> than, the, <laughs> than the profit. <laughs> Yeah, this is this is kind of this this does kind of give you those. Uh, oh man, yeah. What does it do to your head? Last, now we're in single digits in time left. We're down to eight minutes. Eight minutes. Things could get uh, spiky now. Just make the limit a hundred. I'm thinking of it. Yeah, no, can, no. Can, we, can we go? Can we do it? <laughs> what do you think, Paul? Hundred cars. The dinging's gonna drive everybody nuts. But go for it. I don't care. <laughs> You guys go for it. Wait, wait, wait. Now let's keep it. Let's keep it going. Keep it to ten. Keep it to ten cars. Okay. Well, I, pretty, I mean, the natives. Yeah, I just I'm curious to see because it's been such a good match, so close. All right, now Gas has got one going against him here, just a little. Gas, just hold it, hold it, hold it, man. You will go in your direction. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, if it goes against you, and you if you. If you take it exactly wrong, it can really mess you up. With he's got ten on. Gas, just stay guess, focused. Exactly. Stay in the trade. But you know he's he, he gas trades without protection, right? He doesn't have a he just manually pushes the button. But you don't have a a stop above you. Think you think as a doctor he would use protection? Yeah, I was thinking that. I think that's what his protection is. He's a, he's a doctor. <laughs> Uh, it's going against him. He's like four ticks off. He's going. He's like 
375 off of this trade. But that's really not a whole lot, really, considering he's up 12,600. Do that's not worry, good. boy. And go. He's got, got worry. He's got what he's doing. He's trying to get to 200. <laughs> KMI here popping the highs of the day. KMI, the highs of the day, continues to look good. And uh, look at that VIX here. Just pumping it. Yeah, all three indices are still positive. KMI here pushing highs. Rovi here pushing highs, right? We got the Rovi on the move. And here comes Brazil Foods. Brazil Foods here starting to grind back up. Uh, I took a loss there. One tick. We took a loss. A rare cur currents here at the Ultimate Trader Showdown. Five minutes left to go. What's the score? Uh, twelve. Yeah, go ahead. yeah, I can do it. Uh, twelve thousand four eighty-seven. You have, of course, and uh, twelve thousand one hundred twenty-five. Jesus. Uh, twelve. Yeah. <laughs> Close. Yep, and he's uh, he's flat right now. He's trying to get along. You can't shake this guy. You can't shake him, Gas. Oh, he's uh, he's twelve two fifty now. Do you know why they call it infinity futures? Because <laughs> when you trade like this, your commissions are infinity. Yeah, pretty much. A hundred. Oh, he's ahead of you now, Gas. He's got you by like 20, 25 bucks. P Pandora Media yes. spiking more in, into the I think close. you're leaking something. Even though, it goes, even though it's probably going to come down to it's going to come down to uh, commissions, and Gas might pull this one out. This might get uh, you know this might be a. Uh, a, a, a pride trade here. Who's going to end up with the best trading uh, score after before commission? I mean, this is actually going to come down to the wire. Yeah, RPM, it's an ego you know, thing. Four o'clock now. Remember to flatten them both out at four o'clock. Okay. Let me synchronize my clock. Make sure it's good. Make sure because this is going to this is going to set a lot of records here for Ultimate Trader Showdown. High scoring showdown, but of course we have a longer time frame. Great match. Uh, no. Tell you what, I'm, I'm gonna put the uh, analog clock right here on the uh, on the chart. Good, do that. There it is. How do you guys like that TVIX trade? TVIX here and looking awesome. Okay, most unrealistic showdown ever. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you know what? Must. That's your call clock? Guinness. <laughs> Guinness World Record. Is my clock I have in my kitchen? Yeah, yeah. This. Well, we have at least we have a second hand, which is nice. Yeah. I could probably make it a little larger. No, it's okay. It's fine. All right, what do we got here? Well, we got Yankel push pulling the way a little here. Three, uh, 13,250, 12,862. To put this in perspective a little, we kind of, you know, again, we do have boundaries on the thing. We're 10 contract maximum. If we, if we break it down, it's really a breaks down to about a $5,000 account if you use all your, your resources, $500 a contract. So right now they're working on... Uh, <laughs> yeah, j gas is in trouble on this one, Johnny. Double in the... Oh, he's a little he's a little caught short here. Yeah, he's 500 uh, down on this tree. So Kassics are coiled up here on the bot bottom here. Let's see if he's going to be able to... Two minutes left. Two minutes to go. Wow. Gas, you're behind. It's, he's got 14 locked in, and he's, uh, he's flat. Uh, he just went long. How much time left? About a minute and a half. Minute and a half. 
So we get that. Look at the huge volume on the VIX, the TVIX. It's almost like there's something out there. And there's Rovi again. New highs on Rovi. It's ignoring the rest. The market's doing its own thing. Rovi doing good here. Brazilian Foods doing good here. I'm still very bullish on the General Mills. Cable Vision looking good. Diamond Foods, nice entry today. Looking for follow through tomorrow. Overall, great day. Thanks for letting me have off in the morning. We're coming down to the last few minutes here. We have about... Yeah, one minute, about 45 seconds. Yep. 45 seconds to go. Yep. Now, my, my music's probably going to kick on here automatically. Johnny, you won't yep. hear it, but... You have automatic music? You, yeah, yeah. You tech guy. <laughs> well, I missed it so many times, man. It was embarrassing. You know, when, you, when, when you're on vacation, you know. <laughs> and there it is. I'll keep it in the background. Twenty seconds. All right, if you guys could go ahead and be flat here, or I'll do it for you. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I had to flatten you, guys. Oh man, is everyone flat? Yeah, yeah. Everyone hands off the computers. I yeah. still have gas ball, but it might be a delay. Yeah, yeah, he's we're we're flat now. I I had him I flattened him right when his second hand hit right at four o'clock. So. Okay. Well wow. Wow. <laughs> a lot of well, CPU resources. <laughs> I hope you got a lot of commissions. And Let's uh, see what that Arp, yeah, we'll let you do it. Now the commissions break down to four fifty a round trip, right? Four dollars, four fifty a round trip. So uh, and each trip. Yeah. <laughs> so let's break that Less down right now. Fifteen thousand two hundred and fifty dollars, and uh, gas at eleven thousand nine hundred eighty-seven dollars and fifty cents. Very close, about two thousand, three thousand. What do we got here? Fifteen thousand, three thousand, three thousand and change separating them. All right, 1,614 round trips, UTS-1. 1,600, 1,600 round trips? Yes, UTS-1, yeah. And 1,059 for gas. 1,000 round trips, gas. Yep. And you guys only traded for 145. All right, let's see. Oh, that's good. So what's in that? No, 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 no. Uh, I'm trying to get my calculator. Have you ever had calculator crash on your Windows machine? <laughs> Eight cents down from the close of thirty dollars forty-five cents. Seventy-two sixty-three. And forty-seven sixty-five fifty. Still by about fifteen hundred. Did you lose gas? No, hold on. Yeah, uh, seven thousand two hundred sixty-three dollars uh, for in commissions. Versus four thousand seven hundred sixty-five dollars. Uh, yeah, is that right? Is that right? Is it? Yeah, yeah, that's, I think it's right. I lose by about fifteen hundred. So fifteen to fifty. Nice cat girl. Well, you always take profits. You're one of the most dis uh, disciplined traders on the site. Good job. You know, it was a different, different kind of uh, UTS today, John. You know, different. Yeah. Uh, it yeah. went so much longer. He, for, he forced me to trade more contracts than I wanted to. Yeah. You Always messing. To I planned this out last night. I said, I guess it's probably going to come in and weasel his way back into the ultimate trader showdown. If he does that, I'm going to raise it to 10 contracts. Weasel? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Jeez. <laughs> and Johnny knew the other guy was going to cancel and all. So. Yeah, we just had it all. We set you up, guys. 
We, we knew you nice, would be the nice one that job. would want to do it. We've been pugs. So our PM, what, what was the net? Oh, hold on. Yeah, what, is, what is the uh, the totals? Because I just see numbers. You threw numbers up there. I don't know yeah, what yeah, numbers. Yeah. Are. I, I'm getting. I'm you're almost there. All right. Yeah. Unveil it after after you get it figured out. Okay. Boom. Impressive. Impressive. Oh man, it's it's just a lot closer. To EXP EXP reports Q4. All right, so there they are. Um, Yanko seventy two sixty three. No, I'm sorry, seventy nine eighty seven net. It was 787.1 with 812. And gas, 7,222 net profit. Wait, put it up. I need numbers. All right. Yeah. So who's, who's number one? UTS one seventy nine eighty seven is his that, net profit. That, yeah, that's Yankel. That's Yankel. Right? Yep. 797.87. Yep. Net profit. And gas, 72.22 net. Yep. Nice. What a close match. Very close. Yeah, I, I took two losses right in the last minute. That killed me. That was the difference. That was the Expedia. That was the, uh, that was last. It always comes down to the last. That's, that's funny. It's like a basketball game. I was going to say football, yeah. <laughs> football, yeah. Football, basketball. <laughs> All right, man. Well, uh, you guys, yes, thank you so much. Don't go getting upset. You're the better trader, mate. Uh, I mean, seriously. I lost was, twice was now. I'm, I'm double elimination. I can't do UTS anymore. <laughs> you can, so. <laughs> you'll, be, uh, you'll, be, you'll be one of the prime guys because we want to see how it works out with live money. Hey, can nobody accuse me of being a hyper scalper anymore? <laughs> John, do, do yourself a favor. Don't give me money. <laughs> <laughs> You'll All get right. a commission bill. You'll be funding Andrew's yacht. <laughs> it's shot. <laughs> well, I'm hoping you guys will be a little more uh, you know, understanding that you don't want to burn your own commissions. Yeah. Yeah, but I can see that you know, turning into a crazy thing. But I'm willing to try it once. That's right, Night Night. Everybody wants to play me because they know they'll win. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, Johnny, this was, uh, this was fun today how we did this, you know? I think it's pretty cool. It was good. It was good. And, you know, thank you. Yeah. Thanks for coming. Yeah, I have to uh, I'm get out of here early today. Not early, but. Are right, you want to put the, uh, you want to take back over, put the futures up and some music on so I can go ahead and shut yeah. this. Yeah. And, uh, All right. Me, take uh, care, all. Nice going. Hey, buddy. Gas. It's a pleasure. Cheers, Gas. Thanks. Yeah, thanks, Gas and uh, and Yankel. Hey, it was great, great uh, meeting you, and um, thanks for participating with us. Thanks for being a member. Oh, thank you for having yeah. me on. It's a, it was a really a privilege. So thanks. Yeah, I absolutely. love you. Sure. Keep up the great work, guys. Yeah. Thank you very much. Get some sleep, and uh, great yeah. knowing about you. Thanks for sharing that information. Cheers. Mate. All right. yeah, you'll Cheers. have me on Trader Spotlight, please God, in six to twelve months. Oh, oh, excellent. Anytime, man. What I'm making some money. <laughs> excellent. Yeah. Yeah, and that's a good uh, plug, too. Uh, don't forget, guys, the Cuz of Any tonight, uh, Trader Spotlight, 930 Eastern. So we'll see you then. And uh, that's about it. That wraps it up. Yep. A nice high Thursday. And we'll see everyone tomorrow morning. Excellent day. Excellent, RPM. Thanks a lot, man. Mm -hmm. You too, Great man. Great show. Great show. Thanks. All right, I'm taking over. Just taking it over. <laughs> All right. See you guys. Some of it was coming off to you guys once again. Some of it was.